In this Sailing Doodles, we sail from the Italian island of Sardinia to the French island of Corsica in a brand new Fountain Peugeot 47. We flew from Miami with three stops all the way to the island of Sardinia to the city of Olbia. All right, so we will do better introductions here in a minute, but we just got to the boat. So we're on uh, the boat with Steve and Loretta. This is Loretta. Hi. And this is a 2018 Fountain Peugeot? Yes. 47? Yes. We're gonna be sailing with you guys in Italy for a while. And there's Steve back there. Hey everybody. So we'll do kind of a proper introduction in a minute, but we're just getting off the dock. So I'm gonna film us getting that off the dock and then we'll, we've already toasted with champagne and everything. Champagne toast. That's right, we'll no. do another one. Yeah, we'll have to do yeah. another champagne. Oh, just we'll, for the video. we'll do one a champagne. tequila toast. Oh no. Tequila toast too. <laughs> All right, well, for now. For now, tea for now. Tea toast. Proper tea toast. <laughs> So we got off the dock in Porto Cervo and headed towards Corsica. Once out in the open ocean, it was time to put up the sails. It was perfect condition to put out the top-down furling Jenniker. Guys, take this episode. Yay! What do you think, babe? Pretty I nice love out it. here. Yeah, it's Maybe pretty nice. Maybe we have one too. It was only a few hours sail from Sardinia up to Corsica and the city of Bonifacio. All right, so we're pulling up to Corsica right up here. There's big cliffs and everything. Castle up there. We're gonna go check out big fort. Should be a lot of fun. I'm looking forward to flying the drone here and get some cool shots. Do you use the um, lifeline or do you use the feet? I don't think I'd seen a prettier and more protected port ever. Obviously in the Med, it's all Med-style mooring, and the French and Italian islands have what's called sand lines. Sand lines run from the dock to a sunken block out there in the middle of the channel, and you connect your bow of the boat to it. This line is gross. Hey, here's a snorkel. <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, I think I'll let that just stay on there. All right, well, we didn't have time earlier. We were getting off the dock in a hurry, so we actually did a champagne cheers and toast and everything. So Very nice. Yes, thank yes. you. But let me introduce you to the owners of the boat here and the crew. We've got Steve and Loretta. Come here, Louis. And Louis. Hey, everybody. Woo! Hi. Yeah. This is Captain Kiki Boom. <laughs> <laughs> so you, uh, you guys own the boat. You're sailing around the Med for a while. What's going on? Yeah, we took delivery of the boat in La Rochelle, France last July, and then sailed down the coast of Portugal into the Med have been here since then. 
Cool. Well, thanks for having us on. We actually met in uh, Key West, like episode six of Sailing Noodles. Yeah, we're in we're in episode six. You can see us <laughs> sitting at a bar next to Bobby. Right. So <laughs> it's very so, exciting. So knew we'd be great friends after drinking all the tequila. That's her problem. <laughs> right, so. And then Luik, uh, tell us a little about you. Um, French captain, uh, boat technician, and uh, sailing around. And a good guy, all around good guy. <laughs> cool. So what's the plan for the next week or two here? So with you guys as our guests on board, we're going to spend the next four days in Corsica, part of France. This is Bonifacio, where we are now. We'll spend days at Coves and then a couple other cities. Then we're crossing to Italy, where we'll spend about a week in the islands of Ischia, Presidia, and Capri. Cool. That sounds amazing. I mean, it's already... It's a pretty amazing spot. So thanks for having us out and uh, glad you're here. Cheers, guys. Cheers. Cheers. Yeah. <laughs> cheers. <laughs> they had beers earlier. Don't, we're not. <laughs> yeah, we did. It, yeah, but anyway. All right. <laughs> Let's go do something fun. So fun. First, we lowered the dinghy into the water to go explore some of the caves and coves in the bay. One thing that you really shouldn't skimp on when setting up your boat is the dinghy. Make sure it has a big enough engine to zip you around wherever you'd like to go. We're going to check out the fort on the top of the hill. What's the name of the fort? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Some tour guide you are. <laughs> you said it's never been I just, conquered. I just brought you here. I don't oh, know okay. Think okay. Called. Well, apparently, it's never been conquered. They, the Germans had this in World War II, and I don't know. There's some history. I'll look it up somewhere. So we headed up the hill to see the citadel of Bonifacio that protects the city. The citadel was first constructed in the 9th century at 230 feet above sea level. Did you get bumped? It's a fairly steep hill. You breathing hard? hard Kinda. Breathing. are calculated specifically so that when those rollers start coming down and lift the drawbridge, they keep a constant pressure on the bridge as it closes. So it just so it's, it goes, speeds up here and slows down here and then stops. That's cool. They had that ability back then. Hey, but they good at math, man. Smart guys, right? Just don't yeah, don't skip on your computer. Right? No <laughs> slide rule, maybe. Probably not even that. Yeah. De boiser puissant, Danny. Ouais. Pas trop frité, plutôt de boiser. En bouteille. Oui, en bouteille. This is what oh, we yes. brought, Louis. Forget yeah. the sailing help. We brought our own interpreter. <laughs> C'est bonjour, ladies. Bonjour, mademoiselle. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. Santé. We got a collar that way. A traditional Corsican meal is dried meats, cheese, and wine. Who are we to disagree with that? So what do you think? Pretty cool little spot, huh? There's wine everywhere. What do you think it oh, is? You think they play bocce ball here or something? They do. Yeah? They really all do. All the French squares, it's a legit thing. The old guys show up and they Every town has a square. This one's not the roof right now, but the little towns are legit little towns. They all have it. It would suck having to walk up to your apartment with that every day. That's why you buy groceries every day. Yeah. Because you're not going to take my. Look at that. <laughs> yeah, That's carry cool. all that stuff. Yeah, you'd be pretty pretty buff going up and down. Your, ca you'd have, your calves would look amazing going up and down that all the time. Seriously. 
<laughs> you want to see him? <laughs> Is she going up the stairs? <laughs> I thought it was pretty neat being able to see the mechanical linkage on how these doors operated. <laughs> and they're not, this is not, they're not the same like height. So like, so you know, it's like not OSHA compliant. I mean like one of them's short and then you're like, ah, there's the next one. I think this is safer. No, we don't need no sneaking OSHA. <laughs> <laughs> your first, end of your first day, you guys, in Europe. This is really nice. It's a different, like I like the Caribbean sailing, but this is totally different. This is more about touring Europe on a boat. Very right. different. Right. Very different. Very different. Well, to a good first nice day, guys. First day. Woo! Woo! Cheers! Hey. I'm out of wine. I'm out of, yeah, <laughs> I guess cigar. Boom. There okay. you go. <laughs> there you go. Thank you. Thanks for having hey guys. Thank you so much for having us. Oh, this is awesome. Yeah, like, you're great. part of oh, our history. Yeah. This isn't me. Be sure to check out our next video and give you a proper tour of the boat. Thank you so much to our patrons for making this channel possible.